Hey what's up guys, my name is Sukao Fire, and today I'm going to be comparing the USP versus the P2000 because honestly I feel like the vast majority of CSGO players use the USP without really knowing the difference between it and the P2000. Today I'm going to be explaining why it may or may not be the better weapon and I'll be determining this as per usual by using the CSGO weapons spreadsheet which you can of course find at the top of the description. Well, to start it off, if I'm gonna keep it real with you boys, the P2000 is pretty much an unsilenced USP except for one thing, which is the accuracy, which we'll get into a bit later. But this honestly might be surprising for a lot of you, because they pretty much are the same in a lot of different ways. They both have the same fire rate, armor penetration, and damage fall off. But now let's get into some of the main differences. The first one we'll go over is bullet count. The P2000 is 13 bullets compared to the USP's 12. Now this may not seem like a huge difference, but on pistol rounds this can honestly make the huge difference because ammo management on CT pistol rounds can be a pretty big factor. Going along with that, the P2K also has 52 bullets in reserve compared to the USP's 24 meaning the P2000 is over double the amount of bullets as a USP, but for some reason a really small amount of CSGO players use it over the USP. Now let's kinda get into the reason why I assume a lot of people use the USP, and that's for the accuracy. The thing's got a silencer, it looks pretty spicy, people probably assume it's more accurate, it does feel a bit more accurate, but let's actually look at the stats. The funny thing is, is that the P2K and the USP in accuracy really aren't that different either. While standing, the USP has about 1.7 meters more accurate than the P2000. And while crouching, the USP is around 2.6 meters more accurate than the P2000. So the only reason why the USP is better than the P2000 is like a meter or two of accuracy. So... Honestly, the P2000 is pretty underrated, man. I really don't think anybody is using the USP because of its silencer, because having a silenced weapon on pistol rounds really isn't that useful, because you're most likely gonna be getting rushed by Glocks and taking close range fights overall, so a silencer really won't make that big of a difference, while with the P2K, an extra bullet can definitely save your life. And even if you are taking long range fights, a meter or two of accuracy really shouldn't affect it that much. So uh, in conclusion, the P2000 is pretty much better than the USP in practically every sense except for the accuracy. I'd say that's a pretty fair trade off if you get double the bullets with it and one more bullet in the magazine. So hopefully these stats can convince you guys to join the P2K gang, but besides that, that pretty much does wrap up this video, so if you guys did enjoy, don't forget to leave a like and suka scribe, and feel free to leave a comment if you are now part of the P2K gang, but besides that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.